board. What's up, everybody? WAC 463 in the place to be, and welcome back to another episode of Shot in the Back. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna go crazy here, Stone Post, and I'm gonna sing. <laughs> are you are I'm ready? ready? I'm I mean, ready. We, do it, do it. we are we are at a month of uploading Shot in the Back, so so I'm. It's I'm like when do you're you're with your ditty. girlfriend, you know, for like that first month, you celebrate, right? Yeah, you get like strawberries and stuff that you'll never <laughs> do when when you get old with that person. You you just go all out there in like you the go first month. And it's all out of your system. So, um, let's see. This is this is probably going to hurt everyone's ears. So turn your volume down and then gradually turn it back up to listen. <laughs> but uh, I hope I don't kill anybody here. So, uh, shot in the back and you're to blame. You give Cod a bad name. You sat in the corner. Now I'm done with this game. You give Cod a bad name. All right, I, I, was, I, had, I just I just turned my <laughs> cell phone on. I had it like lit up here. I was like, I mean, if you're as old as me, you used to be lighter. Tone. Yeah, <laughs> you're, you're gonna end up downloading this. That was awesome. Be your ringtone when Josh, I call. Josh, man, you overachieved. Oh, thank you very much. So we got advanced warfare on the table today, and we're just gonna like pick it apart and talk about boners. I do. Yeah, I mean, everyone. I mean, I wake up with a boner, so. Let's let's t- let's not talk about that. <laughs> have you have you had wet dreams about advanced warfare? Yet? No, I have not yet. Although I can tell you, I love Kevin Spacey, and Dude. and when I saw him in the the advanced warfare video, their little teaser, I was like, dude, um, I'm excited. I'm totally excited. But there's a lot of cool stuff. There's a lot of cool stuff out there. I mean, we can go through it. Uh, you know, like the mechanical suits, exo- exoskeletons, the static gloves where you can climb the walls. I mean, yeah, it, yeah. hold on, hold on. You're going way too yeah, fast. I know. I'm way excited. Too fast. I'm excited. So, so before we get into that, real quick on the Kevin Spacey thing, do you watch House of Cards? No, I do not. Oh, dude, there's this major correlation between what he says in the trailer and like his. Um, the person that he is in House of Cards. The so whole idea of like yeah, this dude, mercenary it, army on, that could take over the world. It's on. No, not like that. But just kind of um, the the president talk and everything like that. And uh, House of Cards left off with a cliffhanger where he's going to be president. And so uh, uh, I there's didn't definitely that, yeah. some some correlation there. And I just think that's really cool. So. Um, Side note: Watch House Cards if you haven't. But let's let's get into this. And I'm I'm gonna pick out the first thing that's probably on everybody's mind and go straight to Insta Tense. Insta Tense. That, that's yeah. that wall that you can like put up to to give yourself a barrier. Yeah, it's got to be. I mean, we talked about this a little bit. It's got to be a support streak in my mind. It's it's got to be. It's There's n- no way this is like a Claymore or a Bouncing Betty or something like that. It's not gonna be something where it's just in the equipment that i just think that's way too op i mean it makes sense i mean a, a total support streak where you're playing capture the flag or domination and you want to hold down a point and you've got the perfect i hate to say it camping spot and you drop that tent down and you just own the objective i mean i think yeah. how awesome is that I, I think it it sounds cool, but think about this: four guys, four guys run it. Let's, You're let's so negative. Four guys run it. I know, I know, I know. I'm always picking things apart. That's what I do. Um, so four guys run it, and they make a square, and they sit in it. Yeah, C4, done. Yeah, if you could get close <laughs> enough to toss a C4. Whoa. So just that's that's my thought. You know, four guys run it. They make a square. You know, and I would say you made your bed and, laying it. <laughs> yeah, and they will. They will. <laughs> so I mean, I'm not. I, I'm really not not concerned. No, but about you're right. This. People could totally abuse that. Yeah, yeah, but I'm still. I'm not concerned about it. I don't think it's going to be something where uh, we see a lot of it. I think people will play around with it for a little bit. It'll be you know kind of annoying if if you get you know some stuff where four people do it. But I don't think it's that big. So let's so. let's get to the. 400 pound gorilla in the room now when i watched this and you did the spoof it was brilliant but (laughs) i mean this is like a three-way menage a trois between halo cod and titanfall when i watched that trailer i was like oh my god my my last five years of fps just went to bed and had this baby called advanced warfare Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. what do you think well, let's let's think about it real quick. So the the modern warfares and everything like that has been, you know, kind of this time period. You know, it's kind of the time period we're in. If you look at the guns, you look at the technology, you could say, hey, we are 
at that level or we're close to that level. So what do you do from there? Where do you go from there? And it really comes down to those kind of power suits and robotics and, and things like that. Because that's, you know, when we think about the future, we kind of think spaceshipy or, or robotics power. You know, we, we're kind of moving towards that. So it's it makes sense that they're making this move. I will bring up a lot a lot of people, and I did poke fun at, at the trailer with my, my uh, spoof, but it, it wasn't serious. It was just for fun. When I look at this... This is a natural thing for Call of Duty to do. This is a natural order of what they should be doing. So I'm, I'm really not, uh, not upset about it. I think it's going to be cool. Yeah, I think it's going to be cool. And, and, and you do a spoof. You know, ninety percent of all jokes are based in fact. Otherwise, they're not funny. But right, you, right. you brought fact and took and made light of it. And yeah, it, it is what it is. But I'm excited about it. You're, you're right. That's the natural progression for the video game. I'm not upset about it. What I'm excited about, and we'll end on this, I guess, but new engine. And I did a video about this a couple days ago. It's going to right. be a completely new engine. And what you talked about in our pre-talk uh, before this commentary is, hey, this, this game's been in development, and they've said it for two and a half years. So mm-hmm. let's not just think, oh my god, they just stole everything from Titanfall. I don't think you yeah. can turn that size of ship around on a dime. I mean, this isn't a canoe. You know, this is an aircraft carrier. You can't right. just do that. What do you think, Josh? Yeah, I agree. There's no way that uh, that they were like, hey, look, Titanfall came out, and people love it, um, and let's just copy a whole bunch of stuff from that there, there's no way you know they they've been working on this like you said for two years they've been developing it uh one of the first things that comes out is the artwork uh so for them to go and and turn around halfway through and say hey we're gonna scrap everything we've done and we're gonna go this route that that definitely didn't happen so this has been developed this way since before titanfall was even you know the first trailer even came out um, but it is fun to see that kind of correlation. And, and really, one last thought here is that Titanfall really isn't that popular a game. I mean, it is to some people, but if you look at the general population of Call of Duty players, first-person shooter players, Titanfall really isn't that, um, that popular. So for them to say, yeah, they're just copying Titanfall, well, that's a mistake. You don't, you don't copy a not popular game. You copy a popular game. Right, which Titanfall did. <laughs> yeah. and, and one thing, one thing that uh, that a lot of people haven't talked about is kind of the the invisibility thing. And I know we're we're running way long, so maybe you could put a a couple of gameplays in. But uh, the invisibility thing, the cloaking. Uh, what do you think? Uh, you know, Predator just uh, just came out. It cloaks. It it does all of that. Um, on Ghost. So what do you think? Is that going to happen? In- yeah, I see it happening. I mean, a lot of the things we saw in that trailer, I do not think translate necessarily, you know, like the little hover motorcycles. I don't think they're going to translate into the multiplayer gameplay. I could, Yeah, I couldn't see it translating into the multiplayer I don't see that. Gameplay. I mean, maybe the spider tank, something like that is a kill streak or whatever. But the cloaking, yes, I see that. And I see that more of, of like a specialist streak. You know, I don't see it as right. like a kill. It could be a kill streak. Wouldn't be a support streak. Could be a specialist streak. You know, you get on your specialist streak and you're 10 kills in, you get cloaking. And, uh, you know, I played the new maps today and you can still see the Predator. I mean, it's oh, yeah. it's blurred. You know, everything mm-hmm. around it's blurred. But, yeah, I don't know. It's cool stuff. Hey, got to get inventive. I mean, you can't do the same thing over and over. I mean, you can. And you, you expect can. the same and results. That's, that's called insanity. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that's what they've done. And, and honestly, what I'd like Our to see is, is this, t- this title come out, and then I'd like to see the next title be something that's, that's back in the day. You know, like kind of kind of um, two opposite ends of the spectrum, right. if that makes sense. Bookends, so, let, yeah. Let us know in the comments if that's something you would want to see, and make sure you slap a like on this, and I'll let you do the outro, sir. <laughs> hey, guys, we really appreciate it. If you've been with us for five episodes, uh, you guys are all stars. And if you haven't seen the other ones, uh, check the link in the description. We'll drop those down there, and we appreciate you guys. Take care as always. This is Stonepost34 and Josh. Peace.